Hey everybody, Balian here. I'm um, just going to show you something that's happening in the graph editor here. I'm going to bring my controllers on. I'm with my grade 12 class here, uh, NURB controller. So I'm selecting a, a controller here. As you can see, it's uh, spaghetti noodles and then it goes really wild on me sometimes. So you saw that earlier. And if I keep playing here, let me just do something and let's pick something and, um, and see if we can recreate that issue again going to rotate E, it's a concern of mine right now. And sometimes what's happening is uh, if I'm playing around here in the graph editor, this is getting going abstract on me. I don't know why. And, uh, you know, these things happen. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get out of this, uh, this, this version, which is the newer version, okay? And what I'll do is I'll just... Uh, I mean, I'm just have a moving hold here. I gotta fix that for a second. Okay, so what I want to do is go back to the classic, classic arrangement in here because this is the, the more intuitive one, 2018 and 17, the same thing. However, if your graphic card is really much older than, let's say, two, two three years, you may have issues here, which I have at times. Um, so subsequently, I researched. What I'll do is I'll record it for you guys, so you guys don't have to ask me how to reset your uh, graph editor. Two places right off the bat: display in uh, preferences so notice here Maya preferences I went there I can also go to Maya preferences down here we're gonna take care of display and animation display and animation okay so display I think we're gonna go to OpenGL legacy right here yes and we have to restart to make this a go I'll press save okay watch that was step one I don't have to save right away, but I like to do things slowly. So display, notice that now I've changed it to legacy and second animation. And instead of going to graph editor again, to modern, I want to have this as classic. So save, and then I'm going to save this version. Command shift S, here we go. Uh, 03 here. And then uh, I'll just say graph editor here. Okay. GE. Okay. So let's quit out of this, and I'm going to start this up, start it up, start it up. Here we go, Maya 2018. Let's see if this thing's going to work. All right, and I'll just hopefully go in, uh, show this at stars up. No. Thank you for that lovely beach ball. Love it. Say bye to that. We don't need this. Uh, second of all, I want to come in here under file, and uh, let's just go open re recent project. Let's see. And of course, it doesn't have it. Open scene. I'm going to go in here. Action poses, grade 12. Date modified. The GE one is the one I want. I'll do that. Don't save. And just, and let's see what's going to happen in here. Okay, so if I select, you will see now it's the classic. Yes, we love classic, don't we, folks? Yep. Okay, here we go. This is something that's more, um, a lot of people get, um, less issues with. So I'm selecting something in the graph editor, pressing E for rotate. You don't have to do that, but you do have to select G sometimes. Sorry, W for move. Uh, and like, for example, if I press W, now it knows. Uh, some of you may be like modeling something. You'll be coming to the graph editor and you'll find that you're in scale mode and you're trying to move and things aren't moving. They're scaling. So we don't want to do that. You want to stay in the move tool, select your uh, the area that you want to select by marquee, hold shift, up and down, and all that kind of loveliness, okay? So as you can see, now the graph editor is clean. I can zoom in and out. I can hit frame. Frame now. I've got everything. So i got a work to do here. Uh, not bad. Again, for you guys in grade 12, we have five poses. The beginning, the end, the middle, which is that. Uh, where is it? Right here. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Um, see? That's my middle, and the breakdown is here, which Maya helped me do first, which is two extremes, beginning, end. However, we come back to the end, which is this pose here. Okay, that's what you guys are doing. If I can play this right now quickly for you, show without nerve curves, and then let's just click out here and play. That's what you guys, you could be a punch, or it could be uh, noticed now. I'm, I'm noticing that. Let me go into graph editor. There's something else. I think it's playing every frame haha <laughs> because we had set reset it so another thing to worry about time slider forget every plane every frame and do 24 frames per second so if i press frame uh, play now it's a lot better a little concerned about that part here i'm concerned about my elbow so i'll fix that and show you guys in class how to do that okay 
Uh, Ballionette, I think this is a short video. What did we do? Under five minutes. Bye-bye.